Hey YouTube, thank you for visiting the channel. Wanted to give everybody a quick update on my uh, US General Series 2 toolbox. I've officially completed the setup that I was going for. As you can see there's a 72 inch bottom and there's a 56 inch top chest along with a 16 inch side locker and the uh, 14 and a half inch side cabinet on the back. Um, really really happy with the setup so far I'm going to show you around this is not going to be a toolbox tour of all the stuff on the inside but more of an overview on some of the options that I chose uh, and, and basically why so uh, one of the things that I wanted to show you is I added the uh, handle onto the side of the side locker that's basically not supposed to be there that was a little bit of a, of a retrofit um, Got the towel holder, side locker, added lights into the side locker, just to be able to see everything in there, came out pretty good. Just got some Amazon LED side strips. Uh, one of the things that I wanted to point out that I'm not exactly happy with is the side locker and the 72 inch base cabinet do not match up at the bottom. There's probably a inch and a half, inch and three quarter gap at the bottom of the side locker and the base cabinet. Same thing over here with the side uh, with the side cat with the side uh, box that doesn't come all the way down to the bottom either. The other thing when you add that particular box on that does not bolt to the 72 inch base. I had to actually drill holes into the side of it to to mount that myself. Um, and I thought that they should have come with holes already pre-done. Uh, there's holes halfway up the side locker, but it's not bolted onto the bottom either because there's no holes on that. But I specifically wanted the 56 inch top to sit on top of the 72 inch bottom, adding the side cabinet on, specifically to give me this 30 inch wide, kind of like an admin area. And as you can see, the um, the blue starboard is made as a desk and a backsplash and a shelf as well. The handle's installed up there. Little admin area. It's 30 inches wide, along with the like I said, the shelf up at the top. One of the things that you need to know about this side cabinet is these drawers are not the same as these drawers. These drawers basically just pull, and these drawers are had a little dent in them and it's I wish that they were exactly the same but they're not one of the other things that I did is I put the tape into the drawer pulls I think it came out good putting a little bit of black in there and I also did the thing that everybody suggested by putting a nut in the bottom of here to eliminate the um, the closure that's kinda of just a pain in the butt so all my drawers just basically open and close now. Give you a little bit of dimensions just in case you're interested in doing something this big. This uh, is 102 and a half inches wide. The depth of the cabinet is 22 and a half inches. The height with it closed is 65 and 3 eighths. The height with it open, the way that you see it right now, is a little over 86 inches. That's about it. Really happy with the way that it turned out. If anybody's interested in actually a tour of the cabinet itself in the drawers, leave some comments. Thanks. Have a great day.